もしもーし This lineup,、um, it, it can do it, but it's also risky to split against a, a shaker.、Like、do, every other team that know, we've seen. They know where Tia is. They had a ward, saw her run up and meld, so now they can go on her. s p r i t the smoking jungles. Down. Pressure already being placed on Costa, and they just have too much damage. So the first one is going to be a. They're going to see if they can finish off FCR, and he's tanky, but they have plenty of lockdown, so they'll get themselves two, and they'll get themselves some bounty runes. So now he's going to try to assist, and there it is. There is a redemption kill. Planet now on the run. We'll have that sprout up in a second, but I'm not sure if King Jungles will opt to go for it. I think a one return kill, but that's, you know, first blood, one extra kill, and four bounty runes. Every single bounty rune to Dire has a massive advantage to have in the start of the game. Just, you know, looking at the net worth already on the heroes before lanes even start, it's absurd the difference. All right, this mid matchup,、uh, I think it's going to be a bit tough for Analog. Nothing to say. Very, very well known. Excellent player. One of the top ones.、Uh, I think that Analog has his work cut out for him here. Yeah, at least he did、uh, get forced to skill Fisher because of the level one fight. So, doesn't have the early enchant totem aftershock here.、Um, so, going to give him a little bit of a, a chance here on mid. And also, no first blood was given to Shaker. But, yeah, for sure, Shaker does pretty well in this lane. Right, so, talk me through these lanes, Waga. What are we going to be seeing?、Attack. What do we expect to see? Well, bottom lane for、uh, Keepstars is the lane that has to work basically. The TA needs to have a good start here, but the Murta and Doom, they also have some good counterplay with Scorched Earth and W.、Um, so far, lane starting out pretty good here for LGD, getting early level two. The top lane felt like they were bullying this Bristleback pretty hard. You watch FCR have to walk away earlier on. King RD is just going to try to continue to put down some of this harass against why you smile, but. When do we yeah, the see way, this really the activating is, up here? Yeah, the, the way top lane is going, I mean, LGD don't want it to activate. They want to lock this lane down. They want to enable their own pulls right now. They still need to body block the, or、uh, sentry block the big camp here, but Luna is having a very, very good start, allowed to completely free farm. And Bristol still struggling a bit to, to be allowed to see us. Throw at him here on the top lane. This is the big offset in this game. Bristol, I said they need to hit that Agnum's timing really hard, and they're delaying it now with the way they're playing. Trying to just secure the rune if possible. Shards are going to push him up on the high ground, though, but there's the hit, there's the rotation. A nice vision. King RD going to eventually fall here. At the same time, running for you. Can they finish him up? They need one more hit. They have it. Any sort of movement coming out from this mid lane just yet. Doom is going to get used on the bottom lane, Costa. Going to get brought back. And why you smell already in a great position. Analog, though, there it is. There's that rotation we talked about with King j u n g l e They want to finish off why you smile with that dead shot off to the side. Oh, it's going to be able to help finish off King j u n g l e s There's a big rotation to this bottom lane. Still holding on to the Echo Slam. Not necessary. Yeah, they get a one for one trade, but they won't really be able to hold the tower here. So, I'm gonna have to lose bottom tower. They're still farming the area with TA. I don't think that they can defend this anymore as Puck used this coil. They're running away, letting this go. That has a built in way of like having cleave right the side blades, the glaives. And then you just have to. You want to have some form of、uh, steroid and ramp up. Shaker looking for a first move here. Gonna jump in on the Nature's Prophets. Should be easy kill without ulti. Yep. Still holding on to a haste rune, too. So that's a blink, that's a haste rune. Still holding on to the echo slam. So nothing to say. Biding his time patiently, but it's looking very good here. Farm it whenever she can. Radiant are scanning. Yeah, really haven't seen any motion towards that buy angle、uh, in terms of like doing any scouting, any sort of vision. The King Jungle's dish up. Oh my goodness, the jump forward here. From nothing to say. They want to give it a cut, but the snowball rolling on through. Buys a bit more time. s going to try to teleport away. Cannot do it. It was a valiant effort from King RD, but LGD, they were already ready. Look at these body blocks. He said, King RD, you are not getting out alive. No way. And beautiful there for LGD, scoring a big win as well, getting more momentum on the Luna here as well, as well as the Doom.、Uh, King Jungle has gone for a weird build as well on Nature's Prophet. He's going for three points, Nature's c a l l only one level teleport so far. They have nothing to say over here. They know that there's no Echo Slam, so they're going to try to take advantage of it, and they do. They finish him off. They're just trying to place that pressure down. n e w also making his way over. He's got Doom back up now. Look at that snowball. Nothing to say. Teleporting over to the mid lane. Looking to just stop King RD. Good positioning. They'll be able to get themselves a pick off. 
that's really nice for him and they, they get the entire stack without any real contest so a lot of you know they, not giving up the top area they've got absolutely terrifying team fight on top of this so fcr is gonna break the smoke that he's got that, that even just go right into the echo and they don't want to allow him to be able to use this so just a quick and just calculated hit coming out from the side of lgd that's a nice nice move to make this is you know taking away the option for roshan and back they go to play towards mid and the bottom room Shira's already in position grabs himself that shield or nothing to say good waiting ref will keep him quiet but pushing against this lineup i don't think works yeah king Jungle's getting spotted out there's that a test like we talked about falling sudden right fissure everything they'll finish him off a nice green coil but they just don't have the means to back it up yet costa making his way over just so slow thanks to those fire spirits it could dive away egg over to the side king rd trying to finish off nothing to say but he's not going to be able to go to front and get that rock coming into play doom over on fcr costa just taking too much damage with the sunray and everything else that is yet another kill going the way of lgd that was just beautiful. Yeah, but, so we've talked about this when we've watched Spirit games, and granted, Spirit is in crazy TI form. Um, hold on to that thought, top lane they see you, but there's a follow up from nothing to say that Doom comes out, King is obliterated, and Costa does not survive at all. Oh, oh my boy. goodness. The, the bait again going on to the Doom there, but they're sitting behind LGD. Good positioning, and immediately strike towards Rotan here as well before it's so nice. difficult to stop it right now. Muerta picking up the uh, shard thanks to the tormentor. She's got that Pierce the Veil upgrade. She's gonna come in handy. Mid lane, a jump over onto King RD. This is uh, looking not great for him right now, but he's got the snowball. He's gonna try to slow him down just a little bit, but we have the Ag Scepter on nothing to say, so I'll happily take that quick pick. Components and having the PKV just now completing on TA as well. They're hitting a few timings. They're also very close to a full blink dagger on uh, Tusk. Oh, there is a up. nice find there for the side of LGD. No, no. See the value of having those watchers. It's so nice, just extra wards and puck walking up. We can put some pressure because they're just not going to want to take this battle without some of their other heroes. Yeah, and like I said, if he manages to crack a tier 3 tower, that's when Luna, you know, we've all seen how fast she can just yeah, take yes. the barracks. So this bit of damage on tier 3 tower, even though she didn't take it now, is really big. King Jungle needs to be very careful here because he's got nothing to say chasing him around the secret shop. And he is just dead as over in the mid lane. FCR trying to just push away smile and Shiro, but not gonna have that damage quite yet as Amalon popping back in yet again. Wants to finish off while you smile. We'll be able to do it. A toss holding King RD into play. Yeah, sure. Jumping in. There it is. There's the echo slam from nothing to say. They rip apart both of the heroes on the side of Keystars. And now Costa running for his life. This is not looking like he'll survive this either. A very precise hit here coming out from LGD, which is gonna mean that they can go break into the base. They're trying to. Doesn't expect it. Just like they're trying to pit. Oh, pit land. Oh, this guy's good. A little bit of a dodge here on that Atos, the blink out. They can see them so Shiro. They want to try to make something happen off of this. Shard's coming to play FCR, just turning his back, just trying to start stacking all of this nasty stuff. They do have the satanic. It's a good throw in the middle here as he jumps in. They'll get rid of FCR. That thing's is no longer an issue. Goes still trying to kite around the other side, but King RG will be next to fall. And now they'll end up losing King Jungle's analog running away. That is not the way that Keystars wanted that fight to go, and LGD, they feel... Dyer's courier. Oh, some couriers might fall victim to an Aegis Prophet here, though. He's trying, but uh, Neo is not happy about this. Nice little push down to the low ground, though. He's gonna try to run. Nothing to say. He manages to land the fissure. He's gonna hop on over there. Use that. Can they bait it, though? Can they get the damage? Oh, my God. He's, 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 he's absolutely tough, but in comes the Doom. Is the FCR. They split this up. King Arnie getting chased. They have to run away from this egg. They don't want to play against it because nothing to say. Sitting a bit low, but he is going to be all right thanks to the immediate reaction coming out from the side of LGD. FCR just continuing to stack whatever he can. Seven stacks onto new, but the rest of the team, they just, they aren't in position. They aren't ready to fight this. Yeah, it's so super incredibly cool. strong. It's just pretty much a non factor. But we'll buy back, though. Radiant's middle tower has fallen. Yeah, gonna Radiant's try to get out, but the fisher is keeping them in their base. Radiant's I don't think they can analog jump again. They want to show signs of life. They get the dream coil off on the back side, but who do you focus on? Nothing to say. Jumps in. And again, there's gonna be another flyback. The egg is here. King RT, he's trying. <laughs> <laughs> he's trying to say, can. Seeing if they can get 
Yeah, to kill Kostas in his base, practically. <laughs> <laughs> They're not finishing. <laughs> a little bit of a fountain dive before ending this game. Beautiful game one by LDD. Super strong performance here. And, I mean, Keepstars, they just looked pretty lost on the map. I think a lot of it comes back to the... Ara, ara, sayonara.